My name is Mary Morgan, and I have been a teacher of preschool children for around 40 years, and I have worked for university events at the University of Texas for about 45. And I came today to read a story with you, and I'm so glad you're here to share it. It is a Halloween story because it's close to Halloween. And it's about a little witch, and this little witch has a big problem. And so we're going to read our book and see what the witch's problem is. The name of the book is Where Is My Broom? And the lady who wrote it for us is named Margaret Harrison. It is time to get up. Lizzie the witch puts on her dress. She puts on her boots, and she puts on her very tall, pointy hat. Now I need my broom, says Lizzie the witch. Where is my broom? Lizzie the witch looks in her closet. She looks behind her dresser, and she looks under her bed. No broom. Hmm. My broom must be in the kitchen, says Lizzie the witch. She looks behind the stove. She looks in the cupboard and she looks under the table. No broom. Maybe the broom is in the living room, says Lizzie the witch. Then she looks behind a chair and under the sofa. And then she picks up the corner of the rock and looks under the rock, but no broom. I will ask the cat, says Lizzie the witch. Maybe he knows where my broom is, and she goes out on the front porch to look for the kitty. She says, kitty, 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 where are you? Lizzie the witch looks behind the gate. She looks in the bushes, and she looks all the way at the top of the tree. No cat and no broom. She climbs the tree to the very top. She sees a nest of little birds, but no cat and no broom. Something flies by. Swish. What is that, says Lizzie the witch? Is it a bird? Is it an airplane? Is it maybe a rocket? This. No, it is that cat on my broom. Come down here. Come down here right now, said Lizzie the witch. Swish. Down comes the cat on the broom. He swoops, swoops, scoops up Lizzie from the top of the tree and she flies up in the air. She lands on the broom, broom right behind the cat and they fly away together. So maybe they're gonna fly away for Halloween. Thank you so much for coming. It makes my heart happy to read a story to you. And have a happy Halloween.